How y'all doing, fam? This is Chris Rock with Media TV. I'm gonna be dropping this video about Trump. Uh, and some books supposed to be coming about, uh, coming out um, about him in his first uh, presidency, in the first uh, year of his uh, in office. So Trump sends a cease and desist letter to publishers of the Tell All book. So we're gonna see what's going on. President Trump is trying to shut down a new book that has details about his first year in office. The president's lawyers sent a cease and desist letter to the publishers of Fire and Fury inside the Trump White House. The letter demands the publishers not release the book and that the author release a full and complete retraction along with an apology. Among the book's revelations is a quote from former White House strategist Steve Bannon, who called a June 2016 meeting Donald Trump Jr. arranged with a Russian lawyer as treasonous and unpatriotic. President Trump personally responded to Bannon's claims, saying, Steve Bannon has nothing to do with me or my presidency. When he was fired, he not only lost his job, he lost his mind. We can see in their reaction that the fury now is by the president. I'm told that yesterday in the West Wing, people tried to avoid the president, sort of the way you stay away from your dad. The book's author released even more excerpts today, including news that President Trump encouraged allies to engage in partisan attacks against Robert Mueller, who's leading the investigation into collusion with Russia. Starting today, the White House says all staffers and guests will no longer be able to use any personal devices in the West Wing. Well, and this is sort of closing the barn door after the horses over the over the hill. I mean, this book is out. The White House says the rules are for security purposes. Mola Lenghi, CBS News, the White House. So, Mr. Troll Trump, mad because Steve Bannon is about to launch his book about uh, Trump meeting with the Russian government uh, last year. So, Trump want them to, he want them to not publish the book and not let everybody know what's going on. Like, come on, bruh. We need to know what's going on. We, we, he bad and he's scared for the information to get out and stuff like that because they on a, they on a verge of impeaching his ass. So, it's good. I'm glad. I'm glad his ass got in the office because so, so much of stuff is coming out. And all these racist soldiers coming out. So, all right, fam. Y'all have a good day. I'll talk to y'all later.